On the Health Watch, teenagers with ADHD may be more likely to get into a car crash. A new study from the University of Pennsylvania took 60 kids, 16 to 17 years old, with new licenses and found that those who reported having problems with attention, hyperactivity, and impulse control were more likely to have errors when they used a driving simulator. They were more likely as well to engage in risky driving behavior like speeding and not wearing a seatbelt. Not necessarily surprising, Dr. Marshall, but... But concerning. Concerning and important to know. Yes. I mean, because we know that motor vehicle crashes are the number one killer right. of teenagers in this country. So if you know that a child has difficulty with impulse control or difficulty with attention, then it certainly makes sense that they might have more difficulty following the rules of the road. But if doctors and parents know that up front, hopefully there's some measures they can take to try to minimize mistakes. Just strip away those distractions. Exactly. Like cell phones. Exactly.